Oh, hello. Welcome back to my Chanel. I have not worn my real hair, this is my real hair by the way, in a video for so long. Today's video is a haul of the website Doll Blacks. This video is sponsored by Doll Blacks, and if you'd like to shop with them, you can use my code Vessel of Blood for 10% off. So without further ado, let's dive in. First up is this off-the-shoulder small black dress for $39.99. I got size medium and the color black. I've seen this dress worn by a lot of people on Instagram and TikTok, and I have to say the quality is really nice. This is a beautiful velvet dress, and you guys know how much I love my velvet. The one thing I found interesting is that the top of the dress is all ruffles, but I think it does look very pretty and it is definitely unique. I also love how transparent the sleeves are. They go all the way down to your wrist. This is an off-the-shoulder dress, but because the shoulders do have elastic, you can pull the shoulders up if you want to have more of a non-off the shoulder look. This mesh is very lightweight, not scratchy at all, and it's gathered in several places by black elastic. Now when it comes to stores like this that mainly go by Asian sizing, I usually have to get a medium or a large, but in this case I think I actually could have gone for a small. This dress is fairly stretchy and it's a little big for me up top. From the waist down it fits me perfectly, and if I move around too much it does start to slip down, so I definitely could have sized down in this dress. But it's very comfortable nice and warm for the upcoming winter months, and I love the overall design. Next up are the all-match luminous 13 centimeter high heels. These are $58.99, and I got size 40 and the color white. The lights in the bottom come in several different colors, green, orange, pink, purple, and blue. I've always wanted a pair of clear stripper heels like this, so now I have them. They fit me perfectly, they are very comfortable, and at first when I took them out of the packaging, I was looking around trying to find the on button or some place where I could put a battery in the bottom of the shoe, but uh, you light these up by just stomping on the floor or, you know, hitting them in some way. I can only imagine how many times these were lighting up in the package on the way here because as soon as I took them out and started walking around, they were lighting up. So I wish, instead of it just being on all the time, they could have put in one of those battery tabs where it doesn't work until you pull it out. I feel like that would save a lot of battery life because it looks like the bottom of these shoes are all one piece. I don't see a spot where you can replace a battery or anything like that. You'd probably have to completely take apart the shoe to replace the battery at some point whenever it dies. The other thing that I wasn't expecting about these, instead of them being on with a steady light all the time, when you hit them, they blink on and off, much like kids sneakers. So not quite the effect I was going for. I would prefer the lights to just be steady on all the time and then be able to turn them off, but they are still really cool and I love how sturdy these feel. And now we're gonna look at some wigs. This first one is the Lolita Gradient wig for $34.99. The color of this is so gorgeous. I love the orange on top fading down to the blonde, so I had to snap this up. Put my hair back in a braid. And they kindly provided a wig cap, so I'm gonna use that as well. And if you guys are curious as to how I get my long hair under all my wigs, even my super short ones, I do have a dedicated video just for that, so I'll leave that up in the cards. This is so pretty, oh my goodness. Look at that color, oh. I also really like that this kind of hair, I don't know if it'll show up on camera, but it looks more realistic because it's not as shiny as your typical wig fiber. And this is plastic, this is not human hair, but it looks really good. Let's try it on, shall we? It's like pumpkin spice, but in a wig. Wow, can I have this hair in real life, please? Well, I can't see. Do I look good? <laughs> wow, this is stunning. I love how the color ombres down from the orange to the white. It's nice and long. I love it. I also love how the orange kind of comes down into the blonde at the bottom too. It's not just all one color. Ah. <gasps> This is a really pretty wig. Wow, I love this so much. I do wish the bangs were a little thicker. This is the perfect length too. Not too long, not too short. You know it's good when you can't stop looking at yourself in the mirror. I want this as my real hair color. All right, next up we have the Shinso Hitoshi Cosplay Wig for $29.99. This is purple. Uh, they forgot to style it. <laughs> I was really hoping this wig would come styled. Well. <laughs> This matches my pajama pants that I'm wearing right now. My lovely ghost boo pajamas from Walmart. The same purple color as this wig. Oh, I wish this was styled. 
This definitely has the potential to be exactly, you know, that character, but what the heck? It always frustrates me when websites put, you know, pictures of wigs that are styled already, and then when they come, they're not styled. You're gonna need a lot of hairspray. But for a cosplay wig, this is pretty good. It feels nice and thick, definitely has a lot of hair to work with, the color is perfect. The hairline isn't terrible. I mean, it could, it could be a little better, not gonna lie. <laughs> How's the back looking? Never had a hairstyle like this in my life, but I'm kind of feeling it. I like how short it is. It's fun to do this. <laughs> so, I, oh, that is a look right there. That. That is my new hairstyle forever. <laughs> it almost reminds me of Ursula, too, for some reason. <laughs> That's my new mating dance. <laughs> oh, I love how fluffy it is. That's so much fun. All right, on to the next wig. <laughs> I'm having too much fun. And the next one is the Harajuku Rose Red Long Curly Wig for $34.99. The minute I saw the color of this wig, I wanted it instantly. Let's see what this bad boy looks like. Ooh, this one has clips in it. All the other wigs I've looked at so far did not have clips. This looks a little darker than it does in the pictures, but still really pretty. Do, 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 do. Oh. Wait. Why does this hair color look so good? Oh my gosh, I love this. The bangs are a little long, so I'm just gonna pull it back a little bit, but wow. This hair color goes so well with my skin tone. That's insane. Wow, I've never dyed my hair red, but now I kind of want to dye my hair red. This is so gorgeous, what the heck? I love this color. This is so pretty. I also like the subtle waves too. I like that it's not just pin straight. This makes me feel a little bit like Mary Jane from Spider-Man. Again, same thing with the bangs as with that first wig. They're a little sparse for my liking. At least on the sides here, I wish they were a little more full, but I can always cut more bangs into them. That's usually what I do with these wigs. I cut more bangs. The color, the cut, oh, this looks so good. I'm so happy with this wig. I feel pretty, oh so pretty. <laughs> All right, next up is the Harajuku Milk Tea Rabbit Gradient Wig for $34.99. How cute is this wig? It's like the opposite colors of that first wig where the top is blonde and the bottoms are orangey pink. Oh, it's so pretty. It's like a sunset. Oh my gosh, this is so short. This is really cute. I don't know about the length on me though. I definitely feel like an anime character in this wig for sure. And they actually included the accessories that are pictured on the website, these cute little pearl and white lace clips. Let's see, get the whole look here. <laughs> These are actually good quality clips too. They're metal instead of plastic. <laughs> this is so cute and so short. I don't know how I feel about it though. What do you think? Tell me in the comments. I love the hair color though. This is so pretty. Yeah, I'll have to cut the bangs, but this looks a lot better. I like it. It's cute. <laughs> How's the back looking? Yeah, I like this a lot more when it's pulled down. My boyfriend's gonna hate it. He does not like short hair or bangs, and this is both. <laughs> what are these? Are these supposed to be ears? <laughs> I was just looking through the bag before I was putting it away, and I found these. Wait, let me put this back on. These are very hard to clip on. That doesn't really add much to the overall look. I think I prefer it without the weird rabbit ears. Like, if they were styled this way, I feel like that would work. That would make more sense to me. Yeah, that I like. I think that's really cute. And next up we have the Lolita Blue Pink Wig for $34.99. Now my first thought when seeing this was Harley Quinn. I mean, come on, the colors are perfect. So here we are, another super short wiggy. The dye job on this is very well done. This also has more matte hair, so it's not super shiny. Love that. What do we think? Harley Quinn. <laughs> It's so short. Oh my gosh, I wish there was more hair. Cause it, I don't know, it just, it looks strange on me. I don't know if I'm just not used to seeing myself in short hair or what. This also came with accessories. So these are two clips. One is pink and one is blue. All right, so each clip has a white clip in the middle and then it just has hair attached to it. In the picture, there's butterflies and pearls, but that's a lie. Put the blue on the blue side. Oh God. <laughs> and the pink on this side. I don't like these at all. <laughs> I much prefer the wig without them, but so you guys can see what it looks like. Here you go. The blue isn't bad, but the pink one is just kind of 
all over the place. It's not bad. I feel like the, the ends are so blunt that it's not quite as flattering as it could be. If it were curved in, I'll just have to style it so it's like curved in. I feel like that would look really good on me. It's cute. It's very short. Ooh, look at that movement though. So it's cute. I would just definitely want to restyle it so it's not quite as blunt. Next up is the Lolita Silver Gray Gradient Blue Short Wig for $32.99. And you can get this in two different colors, the silver and blue gradient or just plain black. And I got the silver blue gradient. That's really cool. This makes me think of Hades. I love Hades so much from Hercules. Oh, I hope it fits. Rubber ducky, you're the one. I don't know why that's stuck in my head. You make bath time lots of fun. <gasps> this gives me, oh, what is her name? I'm not home. I'm filming. <laughs> I told you I'm not home. This gives me Tessa Violet vibes just because of the cut and how it fits around my face. If you don't know who that is, she's really cool. I followed her on YouTube and Instagram for a long time and she started the wishful drinking trend on TikTok. But she has the same exact haircut except bright yellow. And I love how this looks. This is so cool. Now this is what I was talking about before with that last wig where I feel like if it went in, much more flattering for my face as opposed to sticking straight down. I love the movement of this wig. This looks so good. I love the color, I love the cut. The bangs don't even need me to do anything to them. This is perfect. If I cosplayed, this would be the perfect Hades cosplay wig to do a female gender bend of him. Ah, oh, I love it. Next up is the Lolita Raspberry wig, $32.99. And you can get this crimped or with straight hair, and I chose straight hair. The color of this wig is absolutely stunning. It's like a rose gold, I think it's referred to in the hair world. And the roots are all black. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. I love this color. The length is great. This is definitely a lot of hair. I love how thick this wig is. And then this has the two layers of bangs and these bottom ones frame my face quite nicely. They almost look like sideburns, wait. <laughs> yes, I'm a gentleman with pink sideburns. <laughs> the bangs are a little bit long for me, but overall I love the hair color of this wig. So nice. Every time I look at myself in the mirror, it looks like I have mutton chops. <laughs> Wolverine, but make it pink. And last but not least, the Mobile Games Food Language Cosplay Pink Wig for $36.99. Ah, that's why. I was wondering why this is so heavy, then I realized the pigtails have metal clips on the end of them. You know, it would be even cooler if they came out of the packaging. They're just kind of like dangling. Oh, there goes one. Ah, we got the pigtails. I'm gonna put those on while I get the rest of the wig out of the package. <laughs> that's a look. <laughs> Oh, it has like a little pigtail in the back. That's so cute. Can you guys see there's a little black rubber band on it and then it comes up. I kind of like this though. I'm, I'm happy with just these. They're very bouncy. <laughs> I look ridiculous. <laughs> ridiculous. This class is ridiculous. If you know what that's from, I love you. I think this is the heaviest wig I've tried on all day. Oh, this color is so pretty. Wow, I love this color and it goes really well with this lipstick too. So this is a layered wig. It has some short bits right here and then it goes all the way down to my chesticles. Spectacles, testicles, wallet and watch. <laughs> I mean, that kind of works. <laughs> Try to make it look like the picture as much as possible. Nailed it. <laughs> so this is not quite how it looks in the picture, but I think it's pretty cute. I love these. <laughs> Overall, love the color. This is a lot of hair as well with this wig too. I have no idea what anime this is from, but it's very cute. So that is it for my Doll Blacks haul. Hope you enjoyed. I am very excited for all my new hair options now. <laughs> well, I hope you're having a wonderful day or night wherever you are, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.